It's a scam gang. Is that a thing, guys? Yeah. Is there scam gangs around? What's up? It's Wenji. Welcome back to Kitty Corn. We have a new friend, guys. I'm with Max Mello and our new friend, Derpy Turtle. Hey, what's up, guys? It's Derpy Turtle. Last episode, he actually saved us from getting scammed. And we managed to make friends with Derpy Turtle because he's doing something super cool, guys. That I really want to show you guys today. We are at Derpy Turtle's house. He giving you guys a uh, run through my school and classroom setting. I'm gonna give you some trivia and see what you guys know about scammers and whatnot. And we're gonna go through some scenarios and teach you how to be on your toes around oh, these Oh, that sounds so exciting, guys. Just some background in case you missed the last episode, which you guys have to watch, by the way. Derpy Turtle runs an anti-scammer school in his house. Today, we're gonna learn everything about all the scammers' tactics so we can avoid them in the future. That's so cool, right? Yeah, he must have got burnt real bad to be wanting to make this anti-scammer school. But you know what? We are here to support people like Derby Turtle. Let's get behind it. Go down and smash that like button. We don't like scammers here. There's no place for scammers here. We are anti-scammers. Scammer cops, if you want to join us in fighting scammers, go down below, click subscribe, turn on notifications. <laughs> Turtle, let's go into your house. I want to see go. it. Yeah, let's head in. the house door. Just moved in, so it's a bit messy, but uh, it's on your left. Oh, yes, I can see it's a yeah. little bit messy. <laughs> yeah. Welcome to Mikasa, my classroom. Oh, oh, wow. So this is where you run the anti-scammer school. Yeah, these are some desks for the students. You know, I'm up there like writing stuff. Oh, some this tips. is cool. I feel like a student already. I'm going oh. back to my youth. Yeah, guys, I haven't <laughs> like, you know, had to sit in class for a long time. Max, go up there and write, uh, I will not scam a hundred times and uh, I'll give you a pass. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Oh, is that I what you do I don't like homework, all right? Don't give me homework to do. I only like eating donuts. Over here, we have a place where you can give your speeches or reenact some scenarios, see how you react to some of the scammers' tactics. So this is like a improvisation. It's like role play. Yeah. yeah. It's very oh, improv. It's an improv role play room. That's so cool. There's even a microphone. Hey, Matt, stop eating donuts. Don't call me out like that. I only had one donut, okay? That's my daily quota. You get away with it this time. Oh my gosh, what is here, Derpy Turtle? Information that people should know when they come to the game. You never do a trust trade. You, the one most common tactic is doing trust trades. So always double check. So make sure your trade is correct. Make sure the item names are what they say it is so oh, if they say it's like true. or shadow dragon and whatnot make sure if you see a scammer you warn others so you don't want other people falling into traps oh That's like you did for us this is a full step program guys no trust trades always double check check your trade item names and warn others of scammers <laughs> guys we gotta do it kitty con squad if we learn anything today it's these four anti-scammer tips so go ahead and have a seat i'll run you through real quick and uh, see your basic knowledge Where I feel like I'm class. back at school, guys. Okay, Derpy <clears throat> Turtle, I am ready. Have you ever been scammed yet? We almost did, and you saved us, but it's been a long history, right, Max Mello? It's been a crazy oh, we have been journey. Scammed many times, unfortunately. I think my problem is I'm too trusting, and I feel like everyone is friends, and I really want to help people, and so therefore I've fallen for scams multiple times. The first one was, oh, Mr. Floofy. I, I, I picked up a homeless girl and took her in and trusted her, and she was really friendly. We became friends and everything. She was so sweet and kind, but then she scammed me for my neon unicorn. Oh, that's actually one one of the most common tactics is pretending to be poor or homeless or not having anything just to make people feel bad for you so they give you stuff. That so. is so mean. It takes advantage of anyone with a kind heart. And I got scammed too, but I, I, I don't know if I'm too trusting or if I'm just too stupid, but I lost my neon dog. Uh, luckily, I actually managed to get it back recently. My star, the star of my life. We've been um trying to get our scabber back. We've been really good at stalking her, joining her servers. I don't know what relationship we have with our scammer right now but recently she's been challenging us to a lot of things and we have been getting our pets back which is crazy challenges this is a very unique scammer usually my scammers just do hit and run they just take my pets and run i think the scammer likes to toy with us likes to play with us a little bit you know playing with their food she's definitely evil 
I'm so glad I got my star back. Look at him. He's so oh, cute. Was that a neon dog? Yeah, that's my neon dog. Did you lose your most prized pet? Yeah, it was a neon unicorn, guys. My first neon unicorn I ever made. <laughs> Hopefully, we can get that back for you in the future. You think you could help us? Yeah, teach us some methods. So I'm just gonna test you on some basic trivia on uh, basic scammer knowledge. The first thing is, do you know what trust trading is? Is when someone says, oh, trade me the, your pet first. Trust me, I'm gonna trade you back. Oh, that is correct. 1.4 kitty corn ninja. Hey, are we getting points? Ooh, I didn't know oh, this no, was a no, competition. No, no. I'm not doing any challenges or trivia or scammer tactics. <laughs> All right, guys, so I'm just going to write some stuff on the board. And if you know the scam, just let me know. So let's begin. OK, with... all right. This is like a little, little quiz. Oh, what's the starter egg scam? I don't know I, about this, guys. I think I, know, I think I know what this is. You know how you get a starter egg when you start the game? Yeah. People with starter eggs like noobs, right? Oh, like <laughs> Derpy Joe. Wait, are you scamming? starter eggs. I, I've <laughs> never touched mine. <laughs> basically, they'll just keep their starter egg the whole game. They'll never open it. They just basically take it out, pretending to be a noob. <gasps> trying to get like pets and just being like oh hey you know i just started they just take see here's my starter egg can you spare any pets for me but they actually have like a box full of pets but they just happen to not open their starter egg. derby turtle is oh, that God. oh that you means, doing now i look like a scammer you yeah look like a scammer, <laughs> not gonna lie. oh there we go okay right in front of our right oh it's I a, got cat. a cat all right no pets in the room okay anyways next one no pets in the room max uh whoops has anyone ever heard of the YouTuber backup scam? Oh, oh, no. Oh my gosh, I wonder if it's happened to me. What's a YouTuber backup scam? It sounds like something you could do. <laughs> yeah, I mean, is it something like people pretending to be a YouTuber to scam oh, pets no. from other people? That's part of it. In this game, there's usually two people doing this scam. So one person pretends to be a famous YouTuber and the other one pretends to be a fan. And they're like, oh my God, I can't believe you're in my game. Take this pet. And then more oh. people walk to this fake YouTuber and start handing them over pets. And, oh, and I didn't even think of that. That's evil. Wow, wait, we don't even need to fake it. We could actually do it because you are a YouTuber. People better not be using my name to scam people. I would be so mad. And here's the next one. Have you heard of the YouTube thumbnail scan? No. YouTube? I can't imagine how this could be a scam. Yeah. Do you think it's something like you pretend to be a YouTuber and then be like, oh, I need a pet for a thumbnail. Can I borrow yours? That could be it. But the most common one is like, oh, I'm, I'm doing a YouTube video. Could you uh, put some awesome pets on your side and uh, hold it for a bit? I'm going to take a screenshot of it. And then oh, you mean I'll, of, I'll their trade, of their them. trade window? Yeah. Yeah. Of the trade. You know, those ridiculous trades where they yeah. trade a sandwich. Oh, for like is that how they take their thumbnails? I didn't know. <laughs> So if you hold your trade for too long for, for the scammer who's just waiting for you to not uh, decline, they're just going to accept it and then boom, your pets are gone. Oh, oh wow. That's crazy. I didn't even know. Anyone asks you to help with a YouTube thumbnail by putting your rare pets in the trading box. Don't do it. Just put sandwiches. Just put sandwiches. <laughs> This next scam, this is the one that actually got me to lose my pet turtle, unfortunately. Oh my gosh, Derpy Turtle, you sound so sad. Yeah, I lost my favorite pet, my, my turtle. Oh, that's why you're called yeah. Derpy Turtle. It's your favorite pet. <laughs> it is. And it's the pet duplication scam. Oh, oh. that sounds really yeah. complicated. I actually have no idea. I've never heard about this. So the more I think about it, the more ridiculous this one is. There's this person on the server named Buttercup Cakey. Buttercup Cakey. And they were saying that they could duplicate pets. They had two or three people say, oh my God, it worked. Thanks for the pet. And they're just running off with the same pet over and over. And I, I thought, oh, maybe this actually works. I came over over and uh, gave her my turtle and she just logged off the server with all the other three people oh my gosh max it's buttercup cakey that scammed derpy turtle we, we got scammed by buttercup cakey as well she's yeah. the one that took her into Bluffy. that uh the theater house i can't believe we all got scammed by the same person yeah oh my gosh this pet duplication scam Sounds pretty elaborate. Buttercup Kiki will need three additional scammers to help her yeah, with she this. She got a crew with her. Oh my gosh, that's think, that's a lot of work. Gang. Do you think this is a scam gang? Over it's there. a scam gang. Is that a thing, guys? Is there scam gangs around? Well, we've logged into like scam servers, kind of, right? Like yeah. you just see so many people scamming. Yeah. Oh my gosh. If there's a scam gang, we need to create an anti-scam squad. Yep. That's us. We're calling it. 
All right, Derby Turtle, will you join the Kitty Con squad and become an edgy scam squad with us? I'll do it to get rid of all the scammers in this world. Do it for Turtle. Do, do it, it for, for your turtle. pet. Do it for exactly. turtles and unicorns and dogs. I mean, you're already helping with this school. We can definitely use this. Derby Turtle! We are initiating you into the Kitty Con squad. So I'm going to give you a kitty to put on your shoulder. I'd love one. Let me choose one out right now. I'm going to have this cat on my shoulder. Uh. Tell him that's not a cat. Uh, he loves turtles. Oh wait, I, so I, I, I clicked the wrong one. I clicked the wrong one. <clears throat> oh. hey, is this a cat? What? It looks like a cat. Yeah, there we go. It's I a think, cat. I think it's a fox. Wow. It's okay, Derby Turtle. You can have a turtle <laughs> on your shoulders. You'll just be yeah. a honorary member with a turtle on your shoulder. Wow. Since you love turtles so much, I really want to give you the opportunity to remember your favorite pet turtle. I'll have a turtle and a cat. Hey, you got my cat. Oh. <laughs> You got a lot of pets on your shoulders, Derby Turtle. Okay, Coco, these are your new friends. Welcome to the Kitty Con Squad, Derby Turtle. Welcome. Yay, guys, we have a new member of the family in part of the anti-scammer squad. It's crazy, he also got scammed by Buttercup Cakey. We gotta try and get you your turtle back, you know? Yeah, I want my turtle back. It was a neon turtle, too. Oh. Well, we gotta get the turtle back oh. and we gotta get Mr. Floofy back. Yeah, guys, go down below, smash that like button, help this anti-scam squad get back at Buttercup Cakey. We can find the neon turtle. I mean, neon turtle is pretty special right they are i wanted to make a mega neon and i know and if you guys want to join this anti-scam school to learn more about scamming let us know down below if you guys want to come and take a lesson we went through a lot of scam strategies today that i didn't even know about turtle here could probably teach us a lot more i know if you guys want a second episode with more scamming techniques that scammers use to learn so that we don't fall for scams let us know down below thank you so much derpy turtle this was a crazy class i learned so much no problem I'm, I'm just so glad i could teach more people about the scam techniques that scammers use i know we know so many people in the comments that have fallen for scamming tricks so guys go down below welcome derpy turtle to the fam and we'll be back tomorrow with another anti-scamming journey all right kitty corn squad love you so much bye, bye. bye.